Facebook has significantly increased its account security requirements and account blocking frequency since April 2017. I believe everyone is familiar with the above picture. According to our statistics, the average personal account of Facebook operators has been blocked three to five times. Facebook account blocking is a problem that many users cannot avoid. The main reasons why most people are blocked are as follows. 1. Unstable IP address 2. 2. Frequent operation 3. Frequent switching of devices to log in 4. Using personal accounts to create advertising accounts and place ads 5. Untrue identity information. IP addresses keep changing or accounts frequently log in and out. Whether it is due to switching lines, devices, or network reasons, frequent switching of lines is likely to be identified by Facebook as having multiple accounts or fake accounts, especially new Facebook accounts. A single person is only allowed to have one account, and extra accounts will be blocked, and the possibility of getting them back is close to zero. Many companies doing cross-border business will register multiple accounts through Facebook to promote and attract traffic. Most operators will operate multiple accounts at the same time and need to frequently switch accounts on one device, which will cause Facebook to block accounts. If you frequently switch devices to log in to your account, it will also be considered a fake account by the platform and will not escape the fate of being blocked. New accounts must have a fixed device to log in to ensure the authenticity of identity information. Newly registered accounts need to have a week of account maintenance stage. Do not frequently add friends or join groups in a short period of time. Adding too many friends will be identified as user abnormalities. In addition, uploading too many pictures and videos will also trigger Facebook's account blocking warning. It is safer to add 5 to 8 friends a day to an account. You can increase it after a few days. It must be done step by step. Now Facebook is extremely sensitive to frequent operations of any account, and any operation needs to be appropriate. The main reason why domestic users are blocked is the instability of IP devices and the lack of fixed IP devices. Facebook operations require multiple accounts, and each account needs an independent IP and independent device. If each account is equipped with a computer, an internet cable, and an IP, the cost for the enterprise is too high and the cost is too high. There is another way to use a fingerprint browser, which is also called an anti-detection browser, a multi-den browser. This is a specially designed browser tool that can be used to simulate multiple independent browser fingerprints and environments to provide greater privacy protection and security. Its main purpose is to enable users to log in to multiple accounts simultaneously in a single device. And these accounts have independent browser fingerprints and identities in the fingerprint browser. The fingerprint browser creates multiple virtual browser fingerprints by simulating different browser attributes and characteristics, such as browser version, operating system, screen resolution, plugins, and fonts. In this way, each account behaves on the network as if it comes from a different browser and device, thereby increasing the user's anonymity and privacy protection. Now we will use the BitFingerprint browser to log in to the Facebook website and open multiple windows in batches. First, select the browser window on the left and click the Create Window button in the upper left corner. Then we will enter the interface of the new browser environment. You need to fill in the window name. You can select or create groups as needed. We select Facebook here in the account platform, select custom proxy in the proxy mode under proxy settings, and select direct connection mode for proxy type. You can also change the type and method as needed. Check the common settings as needed. The fingerprint settings can automatically switch to the interface language and time zone of the corresponding country according to the IP address. You can also modify it yourself. Click the one-click random fingerprint configuration below and finally click OK. The Facebook window is created. We return to the browser window page and open the window just created. On the browser page, you can see the IP address, time zone, latitude and longitude, language, kernel version, operating system, user agent, and other settings. Click on the Facebook web page, enter the account password to log in, and you can browse the web normally like comment, etc. We create several more Facebook windows on the browser window page according to the method just now. After creation, click the group control system on the home page, select the latest version, click to enter, click the add window button after entering, check the window to be added, click add, 
After adding the window, right-click the mouse, set the selected window as the main control window, right-click the mouse again, select open the checked window and wait until all windows are opened. Click the group control operation above. Select one key adaptive arrangement of windows in the window operation. Return to the home page and click the start synchronization button and the mouse and keyboard can start the operation synchronously. You can log in to multiple accounts at the same time, which is convenient for enterprises to manage accounts in a unified manner, saving time and improving work efficiency.